So those of you guys in this room with a dream to do something great with your life, and you're kind of average and ordinary, maybe you're not the smartest dude in the world or the biggest dude in the world, but you want to do something great with your life, maybe I can be an example of that. Because I know what it's like not to feel great about what you're doing, to doubt whether you're doing this. And I just got to tell you something. I'm an example. This stuff pays off. How many of you have a big dream you want to make come true in your life? Something special you want to do? Okay. Me too. And I got bigger ones. Let me tell you what everybody's dream is. Put it in your note. I don't care if you sell pest control, security, solar, insurance. I don't care what it is. Guess what they want? You ready? And guess what you want? You want to be happier. You got to link everything to people's happiness. You think that's incre- That's ridiculous. So I'm going to kill some termites. So they're going to be happier. Yep. They think if you did pest control, at the end of the day, the greatest influencers get the people want to be happier. At the, all of you want to be happier. You think if I become a millionaire, I'll be happier. If I get that baller jet, I'll be happier. If I'm making 100 grand, I'll be happier. If I lose 30 pounds, I'll be happier. If I protect my family with security, my family will be happier. People want to be happier. People do not have to believe what you're saying. In fact, too many of you spend too much time trying to get people to believe what you're saying. And you come across like a beggar because of it. You seem desperate. Who's ever trained you to get people to believe what you're saying doesn't get influence. There's a subtle difference that the great ones know. And you've probably never been told this before, but I know it. And persuasion is not about getting people to believe what you're saying. You ready? Persuasion is about getting people to believe what you believe what you're saying. That's a subtle difference, brother. That's a subtle difference, sister. If you start to think through, I need to get people to believe I believe this, not to get them to believe it. People buy things all the time they don't believe. People buy things all the time they don't understand. That's okay. We want to educate, we want to train, but they don't have to believe everything you're saying. If they have to do that, you're going to look like you're begging all the time. They got to believe you believe it. That's a different intention. The most certain person always influences the set less certain person. When you're exchanging with a recruiter or a client, they're either going to close you or you're going to close them. And that's certainty. Certainty is influence. And you can't transfer to me something that you're not experiencing for real. You have to really believe it. You got to really be a crusader. You got to really understand it. When you really believe something, you can transfer that certainty to me. Everybody with me on that? Say yes. This is a huge deal. It's a huge deal that you need to begin to understand that persuasion is they believe you believe what you're saying. I love that most people don't take anything seriously. I love that most people aren't coachable. I love that most people don't do what I teach or that anybody teaches. I love that. That's how certain people win. Half y'all haven't written a damn word down I've said. If you were in my team, I'd slap the hell out of you. I don't say that disrespectfully. I say this as a dipshit who had a Velcro car. I don't say that talking down to you. I say, wake up! You want to win? You want to be a millionaire? You got to quit being so casual. You walk slow. You talk slow. You implement things slow. You talk a good game like you're going to be somebody, like you're going to make hundreds of thousands of dollars. You can't even write a note down. You're going to get your ass kicked in business, dude. Business is a sport. It's competitive. You got to get focused and get in a hurry. Around a dude like me, we will smash your organization. We come to play. We're for real. What are you? Players who implement strategies that get focused and intense, they win decades. They win multiple championships. You win for two or three years. You know how many guys I've known that have made money for two, three, four years that are ass broke now? You gotta win year after year after year to be a player in business. Hey, I fought for it. I fight for the interest. Give me the info. Tell me what to tweak. I like that evangelist thing. Man, that stuff about influence is awesome. I thought he was smarter than me. Turns out he's dumber than me. I want to win. I want to fight for my family. I want my mom and dad proud of me. I want my kids proud of me. I want me proud of me. I want to look in the mirror and be happy with the man I look back at. That he gave it everything. That he went for it. Everything he's got. That's what I want for you. I want you to be happy with you, not cool. Or you fake it in front of everybody here. I mean, when you're alone and you're brushing your teeth, you're driving in the car, you look up and go, I'm proud of you, man. I'm proud of you, brother. I'm proud of you, sister. And you feel it. That's what I want for you. And every once in a while, you need someone to come along and go, come on, let's go. I don't care what level you're at. I'm talking to me as much as I'm talking to you. All kinds of things I ain't doing like I need to be doing.